Here we go. We might actually have this game kicking off. And it's going to be Player, Swanee and Vank coming up against Squiz, Raz, Stray. Um, here on Supply, one map. That's the one in the group stage. Seven games. Uh, that is going to be on stream. Six games for each team. I'm going to see quite a big cave push coming in for Queens right off the start of the game. Stray is going to push through. He is a medic, so they're going for that big medic push. The revives are going to come in. It looks like a lot of pressure being put on Queens from Swanee. Double kill comes in. And the, uh, the race guys are swarming in for the kills, but three, three of the all three of Queens players have managed to stay alive. No respawn kill comes in for Queens, so that that push is pretty much uh, dealt with by the race. Swanee picking up a bunch of kills. Uh, stick on uh, Swanee here. And also shots off towards the upper area. Straight taking quite a lot of damage. Raz to deal with right now as well. He takes him down. Squiz coming in the lower area. And Swanee's done a good job. He's managed to pick up four or five frags in this opening. In the opening stages already. So uh, I'm going to switch across to Vank. As you see uh, Swanee gets taken down. The push comes in. Raz and Stray making it into the lower area. They are going to be pushing up heavily. Uh, Bayer is taken down. Double pistol frag comes out for Stray. And he's going to be able to pick up the flag and force the Axis to spawn back. And that's going to be a really nice first stage for for the Allies. As you see, uh, a pause coming out. I'm not sure what the problem is here. Fight. So uh, down comes the plant. Dynamite and squeeze with that. And then we're going to see the Axis set up towards the CP. Dynamite I'm going to see that big spam defense that you see in 6 on 6. It's going to be really vital that these guys get down a good crossfire on this crossroad. Another pause comes out. To fight. Well, we're going to restart and we're going to, we're going to pick up Raz. See what he can do for 30 seconds or so. Fight. Big three man push with Queens coming across. Team kill revive does come in. Squiz just gets to the CP. It's when he had to kill out. And uh, Stray was taken down. Um, going towards that CP, but it's, it's wide open for the allies to just uh, have someone respawn as a Kobe. It is going to be Stray as that Kobe. As you see, Rose is trying to deal some damage long range. The CP is going to get destroyed. And Stray is going to respawn in as a. An engineer, no doubt. And this looks like maybe Raz will as well. We'll see what happens. And he is indeed Stray and Raz both on engineer. Trying to go towards uh, the CP. It looks like Raz is going to be able to pick up that CP. Got that support from Squiz as well. Maybe Stray going through that cave area. And he is indeed banking behind it. The, uh, the Axis. He's going to get taken down. He might be out for a long spawn here. As uh, the CP is now in allied hands, they are going to be able to have that forward spawn location. Player drop down by Raz. Uh, Raz is going to do the normal jump on um, East Rock. The, the uh, defending team needs to be aware of this. It's kind of obvious if Raz is playing, he's going to be doing that East Jump. As uh, Stray has dropped down at an engineer. Uh, Squiz on the NG as well. He's actually going to be able to get this plant down at main area. And it looks like Swanidius is going to go for that defuse. Raz in cave. Going to try and keep them off. Uh, Swanidius is going to push him pretty hard. Raz does pick up that frag, but he has dropped down. And it's going to be a 3 on 2 for this defuse. As uh, the two remaining players for allies are just going to sit at the top of this hill. Getting some long range shooting off. Stray and Squiz. Big crossfire comes in. And the revives are getting going backwards and forwards. The engineer is picked up. The knife kill comes in. Swanny is killed. By uh, bank, uh, by, uh, by sorry, by Squiz's knife and uh, the crossfire was pretty immense as well by the uh, defending team. Stray sort of caught out with that lean as well by Swanee there. But the start of this map has been brilliant by Queens. They picked up loads of frags. They've managed to take quite a few objectives as well. And uh, that knife kill has insult to injury. As now they're moving the truck forward. Uh, you're going to see Squiz 
Anwar's just uh, play frustration, play and just try and annoy them on the spawn. While Stray keeps the truck moving. Missile 20. Trying to take down Squiz on that east side of the map, and he is managing to do that. Uh, plot going down on east, uh, east wall from Stray. They've given up on moving their truck. Uh, that's pretty much uh, that primary objective at the moment. Uh, so far, the biggest delay they've had is getting that truck into position. They managed to pick up the other objectives fairly quickly. We've seen a big three man push from Queens coming through this main area. They've got uh, the entire defense of. Uh, Erased to deal with as Swanee actually has had to be has forced around the back area. Um, this is again, Queen going with that truck. Big double kill from Swanee. Maybe I'll be able to pick up the third. No, Squiz picks up a double kill in reply. Just doesn't make it around the corner. And uh, the respawn of Erased are going to come in. And the truck's just sitting there at me. So, in a good place. Player going very aggressive uh, on long spawn here. So is Vank. Very risky play play by uh, Erase. As, uh, yeah, and Queens are just being held off from the truck and it's been about a minute and a half, two minute defense just of the truck not getting into, into position. They're finally going to get that, that truck moving. Team kill comes in from Stray. Uh, Ill-timed uh, Nate does uh, take down his teammate Squiz. And it does look like the truck is going to be able to move into position. So the Queen's players have around half of the map remaining to uh, get, the, get this done. Nearly, nearly an A kill for Stray. Player completely taken by surprise. As we're going to see Stray push up. He needs that medic support. Where is Squiz and Raz? He's going to wait for them. Squiz is going to go ahead of, of his engineer. He is going to get taken down. Uh, so Raz is going to give him some support. Uh, this time we're going to see Stray pushing first. Nice free shooting from, from, uh, from Stray there. He is going to be able to take down one, or at least put a lot of damage onto Vank. He's going to be able to gonna get taken down by, by Raz in the end, but Raz actually gets out full spawn. And uh, what was looking like a really, really good start from Queens. It's not looking too good at the moment. Getting, uh, just losing it a little, just a little bit. Remember, this is a best of one, so if they were to get full held here, they guaranteed couldn't win the map. And the moment of race after what was uh, not the greatest of first uh, stages have pulled themselves back into this with a pretty reasonable middle stage. Nice double headshot comes out from Swanee, finishes it off with that body shot as well. Uh, Squiz is just going to try and annoy them on the respawn. He's actually going to risk full here, they, takes down one, just backs out in time. Bit of a, a full risk play. He's going to put on loads of damage on towards Swanee, and it looks like the Axis are uh, opting to fall back a little bit. Vank is going to come up against Squiz as well. Squiz, I don't know how he survived for so long there. That's the push on um, east side as well. Swanee picks up another double kill and a race. Uh, put up, already put up a very good defense. This is going to be at least a 10 minute defense. All we have to do is probably defend for this sort of stage for about a minute, a minute and a half more, and they could be on the course for a, a full hold. More frags and Gibbs coming in. And uh, at the moment, Queen's just being frustrated by the uh, race team. I'm going to pick up Vank on this east side of the map. He's uh, got a lot of damage towards Raz, gets in there's a couple of headshots as well. As uh, Vank, the Dutchman, of course, one of the, well, the very few Dutchmen playing in this tournament, considering it's in. Dutchland, which is of course uh, Netherlands, uh, you guys who don't know. Uh, the land is being held in Enschede, very uh, known location. A couple, quite a few lands been held here in the, in the Wizard Cafe in Enschede. As you see the push through the east side of the map is going to come through Squiz and Stray. And up to go around the back of the map. As you see uh, Squiz getting quite a bit of damage. Um, onto the respawning player, I believe. The three round Queen's push is going to actually go manage to get through the main spawn area. I'm going to go to Swanee in this up top area. This grenade could be really important. He's going to be able to get a gib and a kill. And a race again are holding on. They're going to go ultra aggressive. Raz on the respawn is going to get instantly taken down. Brilliant shot by Swanidius. And 
right now I think a lot of people will be pretty surprised at how this game is going to be going. I think uh, Queen's sort of earmarked for that top position. Um, maybe you could see a couple of problems popping up now and again. Uh, but the race. Looks like they could get a full hold. I'm going to see what players got to offer. I was having some problems early on in the game. So, uh, going to get on some Luger damage towards Squiz. He's got a nice nade for this respawn. Unfortunately, doesn't get anything. The big push comes in through main from Queens, and they look really up for this. This is their real, really their last chance. As the push has managed to get up top. Squiz. Oh, the nade comes down straight. Somehow doesn't get killed. Uh, three, two man push at the top of the stairs. What stairwell's gonna be too little, too late for for Queens, I think. Unless Squiz can pick, pick off a really big three man here. He does manage to take down two. Takes down three. Can he pick off the last man in, remaining in Vank? The revive does come in. Brilliant revive. As Raz is going to push through as the engineer gets taken down. Revive again from, from Squiz. And uh, it's going to be Raz to get that build done. He has to get the build in and he has to get the button pressed. Just presses the button in time. Will they be able to move that truck on as well? Brilliant sh shooting from Squiz though. And I don't think the... Uh, Player picks up that double frag at main actually to to, to slow down the, the queen's attack. It's going to be about five or ten seconds before the next push comes in. And, uh, queens are going to I think struggle to get a time on the clock now. I don't think they've got enough time. As the push is coming through east, uh, we're going to watch Swanidius for the last big push. Nice frag comes on to to Raz as he's caught out with his packs out. That's going to be a full hold for a race. Guaranteed draw for them. But they can secure a win here. Um, quite surprising. A surprising win, I think. I most would, would say. He's only going very aggressive towards CP. He is going to go drop down. That is definitely going to be the end of the, this defence. Well played. Well played to uh, the race. Well deserved for sure. First stage was like a minute long. Middle stage, uh, as soon as it got to that truck stage, Queens took two minutes to even start really moving the truck in. And when you when you delay yourself just for no reason, there was no no real reason for that. They were sort of frag hunting. That is going to be a full hold. Bring up the scores for you. You're going to see 26 frags coming out for Swanidius. I did say this guy was the, the team MVP for a race. People were saying, what are you talking about, Merlin? What are you talking about? As you see, uh, Vank picking up 16 kills as well. Player 13. The damage spread, not too bad. Very even damage. 10.4k to 10, just over 10k. Uh, the, the, the kills were a bit off, but that's kind of what you expect. Prepare to fight. So the ready ups do come in. This is going to be the attack from from a race. Destroy the entrances. They have a full hold to attack the against. They're going to just ammo up at the beginning. And they've got a bit of time. A bit of time. Aggressive start from Axis. They are pushing out. You see Raz pushing up the main road. He is going to get taken down though. And uh, Squiz is going to kill out as well. Stray taking a bit of damage. Mank doing quite a lot of uh, shooting, good shooting there. He does get a headshot onto a Raz. He is instantly taken down. And uh, we see a nice start from Queens on this first stage. They need to just continue and try and get in a bit of defense there. I know that they're going to get the bonus time here because they actually had a really good first stage. They got it in the first minute or so. So if they manage to hold on past past a minute and a half, if it gets to ten and a half minutes, and then any time after that's extra at this first stage for them. You see Stray picking up a double kill in that lower area. Somehow players manage to make it up those uh, rifle stairs, but it's not going to happen for him. He's going to get spotted and uh, taken down by Raz. Squiz going ultra aggressive on the road. He's going to get on quite quite a bit of damage in in there, but he's going to get taken down by player in the end. Uh, Raz also taken down. I think Raz may have missed spawn. He is going to get revived. 
That is really fortunate that the squeeze was on to that. And he's going to take a bit more damage as well on this middle area of bank in position to just uh, be annoying on that platform as well. And, uh, I'm going to keep watching Squiz. I'm very aware of uh, the flag maybe getting taken here. He's going to be able to support Raz getting that kill in. And uh, let's see Queens hold on to the flag once more. So he's going to be able to push into this middle area. Going to put a lot of damage towards, uh, towards Stray. He's going to see Bank. So again, he, I think all of these players are very, very weak. He is going to get taken down. Raz playing on this middle area. He's going to do what he can, long range. Does take down Swanee. A bit of a surprise for Swanee, I think. As you see, Queen's going very slow on their respawn. Waiting for these nades. Let's just allow the allies to push forward. Let's see how far they've got Swanee as a medic. Gonna be coming through the cave. Gonna take down Squiz. Nice shooting. Gonna be able to take down Stray as well. What is player doing? Just jumping to remain with pistol. I'm not even looking anywhere. And that is gonna be first stage again, held off by the Queens. Double frag comes in for Raz on that defense. Gonna try and make it into this lower area. This time around, Nade Frag comes in for Raz. It looked like one of this might have been able to come on a missile back from that damage towards Stray. But Raz picks up that triple kill. And uh, he also killed a teammate for good measure. And this first stage is looking very, very strong for Queens. Their, their defense can't really be questioned too much. Never has been. Never question much raised on their attack. It's taken uh, that. Uh, Truck, truck escort stage. Took a bit too long. Let's see Swanee now. See what he can do. He's managed to move into this lower area. He's going to push up for the flag. Going to take down Raz as well. Uh, stray last man alive at the flag. Going to push forward and take him down. And I don't think the uh, the attacking team have an engineer. They do indeed. I think Claire may, may be an engineer here. But it doesn't matter, he's going to get taken down. The Queens are managing to uh, get this first stage going. You see, uh, they're really sort of slowing down their attacks and that's the opposite of what they need to do. They need to get those, get those attacks going strong. The next push of the raid's coming into the lower area. Yeah, they have managed to pick up a couple of frags. The revives have come in straight, taken down twice, but twice picked back up. Squiz is uh, happy to just sit at this uh, flag area for 10 seconds, or probably. But yeah. that it's all clear, he's got the call from his teammates. You can see the aggression coming out from Axis. Squiz is actually going to stay alive at all. He might get taken down here if he's not careful. A lot of damage coming out, but Stray's going to finish off that kill. And Stray picks up a two-man at this first stage, and at the moment it doesn't look like Eraser are going to be able to find a way to break through. As, uh, they're doing a great job. Just holding them off. And a lot of damage on that respawn as well. We saw a Squiz there putting, on, putting some headshots in. comes Vank with the push in this upper area five and a half minutes just over five and a half minutes remaining he does take down Raz long range and Swanee did manage to take down one as well the revives have come in and when you've got someone like Squiz on your team you know that there's going to be those revives as uh they are going to make it in but they're left on pistols 
And uh, okay, it does take down Squiz on that full spawn. Gonna try and push into middle. Doesn't manage to take down Raz. And another revive comes in. He could have got that Gibbon instead. They just decided to go for the the frag after Raz. It's not gonna happen for him. And uh, Swanee pushing in towards the flag. Isn't gonna make it. As you see Vant get dropped down by by Stray after that and. This first stage defense looking very, very strong. Right now, uh, Queen's not having to do too much out of the norm. Imagining to pick up all the frags at the first stage, a race not really. Mixing it up, even they're not, they haven't seen him bring out the engineer to try and get that plant into the lower area. They have made it into the lower area a couple of times. So you see straight take down player on that respawn. In. Again, that's going to be one player out full for the allies. Swan has taken down as well, 10 seconds before the next respawn of, of allies. So you're going to see Axis just get straight on top of that spawn. Just to try and slow them down a little bit on the next, uh, on the next push. So then they come out. Just go very aggressive. Player is that taken down by Squiz there. And uh, this is looking really good for Queens. They needed, to, they needed to pick themselves up and they have managed to do so. They're sort of proving they are one of the better teams for sure. Their, their attack wasn't great, but their defense is. Uh, if they get a full hold of flag, it's close to perfection, I guess. Try and watch player on a, on the attack. I haven't seen too much of him. He's getting on a bit of damage on the guy in the middle there. They are starting to get some some damage into these lower area players, but Squiz manages to push down, and so does Raz. Sorry, not Squiz. Um, still managing to hold on to this flag area. So, uh, three minutes remaining. I think this is pretty much GG, guys. I'm uh, going to go and just watch the end of this game out. See Squid picking up quite a lot of damage. I was getting a revive as well, but looks like they're going to lose this flag. At least one of the Vaxis comes in straight off on that flag grab. Could have timed that better. This is going to be a, uh, a full hold at, at pretty much at first stage now. So that's going to be a one to one draw. Pretty surprising. To middle, he's going to be able to take Squiz by surprise. He's, uh, this flag area still. The allies have managed to uh, save some face and not have it be helpful held at flag, but this is going to be a double full hold and a 1 1 draw. And uh, I'm going to see these players just uh, finish it off, I guess. I'm not sure what they're going to do. They might go for some plants. So parts have gone down, it's uh, pretty meaningless at this point. As, uh, we'll take a quick break after this game. I'm not sure what we've got coming up next. Uh, Artillery has gone down from the rounds, trying to pick up some some bonus kills in this stage. I'm not sure what the next game I have on the have lined up. I should just check that right now. 
as it looks like the next game I have is a race against craze Should be quite interesting and after that we have Queens again against Trivium the uh, Polish team don't forget a race against craze will be on Adelaide scores 41 kills for Swanee 7.1k damage uh, just trailing behind Raz and a stray squiz at the bottom of the pile but quite high damage so that's going to be the end of that game guys